Hey guys, welcome to episode 17 or so of the Survival Epicosity series. I am still in creative mode, so let's quickly get out of that. Um, I threw all my tools and stuff in here, so they would be safe. Um, and food is in there as well. And my torches. So we want that, then that, then that. Well, in the meantime, I made a storage chamber. In, I used World Edit for it because originally it was going to be handmade and I was going to record it, but when you see it, you'll be able to understand um, why I chose to use World Edit. I'm not going to use it as a storage area um, for my stuff unless I absolutely have to, but I'm going to do. It's the warp storage. There it is. And ta-da! Look at this. Row upon row upon row of like 300 chests each. Like this is the storeroom of everyone's dreams. You just fill all this with cobble leftover cobble that you don't need for mining and everything that's just insanely insanely overstocked and taking up your inventory space that you don't want it's like glitch out on a chest but this all last night took me somewhere around three hours to build um, until I was smart enough to think, derp, why shouldn't I just use World Edit? But it's pretty good. There's no real way out, but I just warp back. Uh, to my bed. Um, also, last night I did quite a bit of mining. As you can see, I have some stuff down here. Um, that finished. So you can put the rest of it in there. Um, got some stuff. That means still there. Look at what I did last night, guys. All this redstone, some more lapis, and I still have some gold and iron to um, smelt. Keep doing this. Um, we also expanded the tunnel. Bam, here comes Magic Woman with her god armor, I believe. Yesterday it seemed as if she decided to stop doing the survival. She's building um, her own little thing. I can show you what that is. Here is Atlantis that she's been building on somewhere. It's underwater. I know that. Um, it looks like she's using World Edit a little bit. Um, 
My world edit skills are slightly better than they used to be. Um, with my handy dandy notebook that I wrote. Um, there are now creepers after me, so... I'm going to do... Back until... I'm done. And hopefully that'll get lit up. But, um... This, we're gonna go adventure more in the mines. Um... And we made a tunnel. Um, here's where we were. We went down here all the time. We can either explore this way, which I'm kind of already doing, which led to a dead end. Um, but Cha said she went and that's where she found a lot of the redstone and the ores and stuff. So... She went down here. Something like that, but... Let's go down here. Down here is where she said she really found all the stuff. She just went down to bedrock. I believe. Oh, she stumbled across the cave and was like, I'm gonna explore this. There's probably a lot of coal that was down here until she mined it. Um, there's a waterfall. Anyway, let's continue down the stairway. She went to here. Yeah, she found bedrock. Well, we can always start just strip mining. You have plenty of iron to continue. Using it for tools. Um, let's see what's all down here. Just exploring it. Hopefully we don't get lost. There is some lava. And usually around the lava there's diamonds. So... I believe I will stop here and start up again when I start to mine for the diamonds. Doing my little strip mining trick. So leave a like if you liked the video, leave a comment if you want to see something particular in the series. Otherwise, uh, I will see you guys next episode.